Hey guys, I'm Jetback3443. Today I am going to be doing a bulk review of um, my Lego Transformers that I have over here. Autobots and Decepticons. Yes, I am lying down. I don't care. But what the Fan, get out of here. <laughs> so let's go over the Autobots. Actually, no, let's go over the Decepticons first. Uh, let's start off with the Decepticon leader, Mantid. Mantid, as you can see, transforms into this pretty cool looking fighter jet. And here is uh, the pilot I designed so he, someone can sit in there. It's just a four stud big spot. And here he is in his casual flight mode. Now if he sees an Autobot in space and he wants to attack, he can flip these down. And now he's in attack mode. Give me a second. Yeah. So here he is in attack mode. Yeah. <laughs> so now while he's in attack mode, he can shoot. But what if the Autobot suddenly starts to get away? Well, we can remedy that. As you can see, if we push these two things in, now he's in pursuit mode which is, I think, looks the best out of all of them. I mean, look at that. I love this, the pieces. So far, this is um, one of my uh, best jet transformers that I've ever made, and I think it's looking pretty cool as well. So, um, let's transform him, shall we? Step one, we want to uh, break the feet apart like that and not let that thing fall off. And then we're going to take that and we're gonna slide it. We're gonna move this up. We're gonna, uh, first off, flip up the head. You'll see why I call him Mantid in a second. Flip these up, flip these down, and you've got elbows. Now we go into the knees, we spread them apart, and move these parts in like that. Boom. Here is Mantid in his robot mode. And Mantid in his robot mode, I think looks pretty cool. So, um, as you can see, oh, I forgot, I almost forgot a step, I always forget this step. We want to take his cockpit and we want to turn it around so it becomes part of the chest. So, so Mantid, um, in his robot mode, looks like a praying mantis because they just got the little foldy things in his thing. You know what the praying mantis do, like strike the insects first. Um, that's what he has right here. He's got the buggish eyes, so, um. Yeah, that's the best I could come up with by using this thing, and, uh, he can walk forward, he's got click hinges in his, um, knees, so he can walk forward, but he can't sit down, unfortunately, so, I'm gonna work on that a bit, uh, so yeah, that's Manted, and his sidekick, um, is based off of Mindbender's, uh, Transformer Null, so I will put, a, I'll try to put a video link in that description, but shout out to Mindbender, great guy, amazing Transformers. Um, this is Raptor Strike, and I know it's based off of a Nerf gun. Shout out to Hasbro. <laughs> so this is Raptor Strike. He is a raptor. Well, no, he's a ra he's an eagle right now. But I based this off of Transform Mindbender's Null. I used the I just looked at it and I said, Hey, I think I can build that, and I did. So here's the result. It's this big falcon thingy. Um, I call this thing Raptor Strike because it can transform into a raptor, and let me show you how. Step one, we're gonna f take the head and the tail, and we're gonna move this up, like so. Then we're gonna take this entire assembly and move it off to the side, and I don't, what I don't like about this is that this connection for me, though, is very weak. So, uh, yeah, the stud grip isn't too strong, but now... To get him into raptor mode, we're gonna take these arms. I don't know if you can see, I'm trying to do my best. <laughs> so then, we're gonna take them, and we're gonna flip them upside down like that. See? It's pretty dirty. Um, we'll take his wings, and we're gonna fold them down like this. Um, so I can show you guys. Then we're gonna take these, and we're gonna flip his feet up move his hands down to get ready for the robot head. You're gonna swivel it around again, 
so that the head is in front, and move it down. And there he is, in raptor mode, though you've probably seen it by watching Mindbender, so, booyah! Yes! <laughs> um, so there, there he is. Uh, he's, this is why he's called Raptor Strike, because he's a raptor. Um, uh, now away with you. Um, next up are the Autobots. Now, I have two fully built ones. I'm working on another fully built Decepticon and a sidekick for the Autobots. And I'm going to continue to grow these teams. So, first up is the leader. I have not decided a name for him yet. But we'll just call him Burnout. Because I think he looks pretty sick. And there's just another driver that I put in for no apparent reason. Get out of there. <laughs> So here's his car mode, and I think it looks kind of messy, but uh, if you can see, I think it looks pretty cool. I think it looks pretty sweet, so here it is, let's transform. There is a bit of parts forming involved in this, so uh, first off, um, we're going to take this part off, and we're going to attach it to the single stud plate right here. We're going to rotate this all the way around and fold this up against his chest. Oh, we gotta center it. I'm sorry. Eh. Centered! Booyah! I'm just kidding, actually. Wait. There we go. No, wait. Oh, this is so hard. Alright, there we go. Centered. Booyah. Now we're gonna lower the arms. We're gonna come to, and the legs are already here, and he still cannot sit down, but he can rotate his legs like this and go out and kick, so, yeah. Come to the back, take his wheels and move them up against his back like that. And here he is! Here's Burnout in his robot mode. He's got a little pew-pew device attached to his hand, so he can go pew-pew and wreck the Decepticons. Um, he's got another grabby hand which can move around like a proper wrist should. And I would try it, but eh. See? Moves around like a proper wrist should. Um, and I just think he looks pretty cool in design. He's here, his eyes, and I like the part where the car comes up to form part of his chest, and I think this was a pretty successful design. So, uh, Burnout can uh, walk on away. Next up, um... This one, it's a helicopter transformer. Still have not decided on a name for it. So what I'm going to need you guys to do is I'm going to need you guys to go down in the comment section below and you guys are going to help me figure out a name for my helicopter transformer. He has a main color scheme of red and light gray. So if that helps anything for anything. Um, oops. His legs are back here are a little shaky because I've only attached them with a jumper plate right there. That's what makes his waist move. And I've only get connected it with a jumper plate so it's a pretty weak connection but it pays off. Not really actually. Um, hellers, hell, uh, bleh, propeller blade do spin. Um, and yeah, let's just transform him because I think he looks pretty cool in robot mode. So first up, we're going to take this propellers and we're going to fold them up and down to make a mini set of propellers. And if you want this to be the propellers, go right ahead. I will be creating a tutorial for some of these soon, so look forward to that. Um, next up, we're gonna come on down here. We're gonna flip all these things down. Like that. Eh, sorry, lying down and doing tutorials is pretty hard. So we're gonna make it go down all the way then we're gonna rotate the waist wee, 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 wee. Yeah. then we're going to not break any pieces and move the legs out and he's got very articulated knees he can sit so I think of him as one of the council leaders uh, keep these arms on because they're only held on by jumper plates too flip these pieces up and they go down 
And then when you come to the back here, you're going to flip this entire section up so he can do that. And here is the transformer named by you guys in the comment section in his robot mode. If you can see, he's got uh, red eyes, but don't let that deceive you. He is definitely Autobot. So uh, I think he looks pretty cool. Chest detail I designed myself. It's not very good, but I don't care. I still kind of think it looks pretty cool. Um, you can not break these arms. Ugh. You can, however, attach missiles into his hips, and you can go pew pew, and you can shoot missiles out of his hips. So, which I think is pretty cool. Um, no weapons designed for any of these yet. I will get onto that. I will make a separate video about that. And yeah, so that is all for today, guys. Make sure you. Sh all right, shout out to Mind Bender uh, for inspiring Null, for inspiring me from Null, and thank shout out to Hasbro for giving me a raptor strike name that sniper thing is insane my friend brought it over it's huge so um yeah uh leave a uh, leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it if you really enjoyed it please subscribe to the channel that would be very helpful to my channel indeed uh comment down below what you think the helicopter transformers name should be and i'll see y'all in another video bye bye